black hoodie, I'm back cooking these goodies. Look at these views from cooking these foods. Yeah. All right, yo, what is up and what is good with y'all? I can't believe it's finally happening. This burger right here came out, I feel like, four years ago in America. The Grand Mac. And because my whack-ass Canadian life, they, like, didn't get it. So I made a video, one of my, probably one of my most viewed videos. It's probably out near 500,000 views. Definitely helped my channel get rolling back in the day was a Grand Mac video homemade because my bitch ass country didn't have it. Finally, four years later, it's here. So I have a Grand Mac <laughs> pitted against a regular Big Mac. Got some fries. I got uh, just an ice water in here actually. I didn't want any soda and I got a few sauces here. Some extra Mac sauce in the back. They give it to you in these little cups here in Canada. That's one cool thing, I guess. And then we got our Sweet and sour and barbecue for the fries, of course, but I'm starving. I'm ready to check this thing out. It's looking very um, Whopper-esque in terms of the bun size. So let's get to digging in. I'm starving and I'm ready. Should I get these Mc, things out of the way? No, maybe I'll just keep them. Okay, look at this thing. Nice and saucy. I just got to see the patty. I just got to see... Like, yeah, it's definitely more Whopper-ish in its size. Okay, we, des we decided to take the, the box out of it. All right, Grand Mac. I think this is how it always, always should be. This is how a Big Mac. <coughs> Should always be. They got pretty, uh, pretty hefty with the sauce. But this is what's up. I'm just intrigued to get a side by side of kind of halfway through each one <clears throat> just to see. This is the regular one. Definitely a different sauce ratio. This one's a bit drier. But let's see if we can. Are they that different? Hmm. When I look at it like that. Like almost not really. It's like another another inch. I don't know. That's crazy. It definitely seems bigger though when you first hold it. Ultimately, I would say. Mm. That a single Whopper still seems <clears throat> more hefty in my estimation. A Whopper is more weighty.
I would go so far as to say that these two patties on this bigger Big Mac or Grand Mac don't even add up to one Burger King patty. Also, these hilarious BTS souvenir cups I've been seeing all over like Facebook Marketplace and shit. <laughs> Mmm. Mm -hmm. That's a crave. I don't know if it's for real, but apparently people are selling these for like like collector's items. I don't put it past the human race. I'm sure there's people doing it like for real. Like Crypto cups. That being said, every time I've seen it posted, there are so many people just shredding the poster, <laughs> being like, get out of here, you're an idiot. Like, what are you doing? Get a life. Pretty funny. Another pretty funny thing. Pretty fitting for the order, you know. A couple of fry guys here. But yeah, man, back in the back in the day, that Grand Mac video. Definitely one of the videos that helped me out a lot. When my views were pretty dope and there was hope for the channel but oh how far we've fallen out of grace was it those burnt ass for <laughs> it's kind of weird i'll just leave that over there don't need the extra carcinogenic uh, fry. I mean, that was back when this content was just getting, getting going kind of deal. It all makes sense. Trends come and go, shit gets old and boring. It's true. That's life. Ups and downs. But hopefully, if I keep creating and cooking and stuff, maybe I'll get blessed in the algorithm once more and get a a second coming <laughs> we shall see we shall see certainly praying on it would be nice would definitely be nice. All right. Well, we definitely didn't need the extra Mac sauce because whoever was working had a pretty, pretty heavy hand. Which I don't mind. I've had a few Macs in my day where They were definitely undersauced. And I would much rather have oversauced. 
than an undersauced. Hmm. Well, I mean, I certainly think, obviously flavor-wise, there's no difference. Size-wise, there's a fairly, it seems like a small difference. But ultimately, I think that size of Big Mac should be a normal Big Mac. Because the Big Mac itself, and I think it's shrunk over the years, really isn't that big of a burger. It's not that hefty. It's pretty light. Not even close to Whopper, but that said, McDonald's doesn't have to worry about that because in terms of competition, like BK is so far behind. The Big Mac and McDonald's are not struggling at all. I'd actually love to know the numbers of like the difference between how many Big Macs are sold in like a given week relative to Whoppers. It's probably exponential in comparison. All right, well, always wanted to do that. Never not stoked to eat a Big Mac. Love a Mac. But yeah, I just always wanted to see Exactly how grand this Grand Mac really is. You know? Hmm. Full though. Definitely full. Till the next one. You know what to do. Eat good, live well. Stay true.